Assalamu alaikum in this lecture you will learn how to query data from mysql database by using php pdo you will also learn how to use pdo prepared statement to select data securely the pdo method fetch all returns an array which you need to assign to a variable and then iterate through that variable so let's start this is our file that we created in previous lecture and this is the query select the static from users and then we created a variable rows where we get all the records using the query and we also used this function error info and we checked that if there are errors then we showed those errors and in the same way we showed the result if there were no errors here we will modify these lines like this for each dollar raw is equal to raws fetch and we will not use for each here we will use y So when we refresh there is no change Let's comment this And after this line ross we will use this dollar was is equal to dollar was fetch all the pdo method fetch all returns an array which we can assign to a variable and then iterate through that variable now we have this in rows so let's first check this with print r rows and here is the array and let's use this html tag pre and here you can see that we have index id and index 0 and then index first name and then index 1 and so on and here we can use different methods like this pdo fetch num and here you can see that now we have array index like 0 1 2 3 3 and if we change this to sock and here we have index id first name last name and email and if we change this to both then we have this and there are various methods and here it is now class object so let's change this to fetch group and now it's in group Thank you very much for watching. If you want to check out more lessons like this then please subscribe to the channel and like the video. And if you have any question then leave it in comment section. See you in the next lecture. Take care. Bye bye.